Alright here, thanks for joining us today guys, going over the 2022 Forest River. That's going to be the Heritage Glen 356 QB. This coach comes in here at 11,249 pounds dry, so not going to be needing a one ton, any three quarter ton truck is going to be more than capable of pulling this coach. Also going to be coming in here on an overall length of 42 feet 3 inches. This unit also does have two complete baths, so kids will be a perfect option here. Maybe have some friends that stay the night there at the campground. They have their own full bathroom with a shower and also have a giant bunk room. And both of those bunks do have opposing slides. So we're going to see how much room that does open up in the bunkhouse. Giant outdoor kitchen and a big custom king bed there up front with washer and dryer prep. Thanks for joining us here today, guys. Going to be going over the 2022 Forest River Heritage Glen 356 QB. So we're going to start here. That's a full fiberglass uh, front nose cap here on this coach. Going to have a cool little LED strip lights on the front, light that campsite up a little bit. Also complete there, you're going to have your docking lights. That's super nice if you guys are running the landing gear up in the middle of the night, packing maybe an early morning camping trip. Also going to have your spare tire in there. Then you guys do have the capability of throwing a second battery in there if need be. Over here on the side, you guys will find a little dog leash attachment. You leash your uh, dog up or you guys can use that as like an anchor point to maybe chain up a grill or something if you're kind of in a sketchy campground. Also going to have a, a big pass through storage here. You guys can throw everything from storage containers to grills, whatever you guys need for your camping trip. Also conveniently located here, you guys will have your solar charge controller. See how many amps the batteries are, are drawing, how much it's charging up. You can switch the inverter off and on to control different things inside the camper. Also going to have a light in there, that way you guys can see what you're doing. Bottle opener, and you guys will have your battery disconnect right in there also. Heritage Glens, full right to the floor there of their more ride entry steps. Those are going to swing up into the camper when you guys are traveling and they're going to make for a stable platform that way you guys aren't you know stepping on a, a shaky typical flip down step they're going to be completely solid also we'll have your guys's tv hookup here that's going to be the same mount that's going to be in the living quarters of the camper so you guys can just grab that tv place it out here make for a nice little tailgating area we'll have your speakers up there you guys will control those from inside the camper you can control if they play just out here. You can control the ones that are inside or all three zones. And it will be a Bluetooth uh, head unit there. All of your cable inlet outlet here will also have your 110 outlet. So you guys can plug in anything you want to. Nice little stylish black aluminum wheels here. And you guys will also have the Goodyear endurance tires. Those will come standard. So not gonna be like the typical off-brand tire that you guys are gonna want to replace very quickly. These will be the Goodyears. Nothing but good things there from that company. Also over here, you guys will have your big outdoor kitchen. This will lift up, that way you guys do have some shade. Maybe we'll be sprinkling, you guys will be undercover. Also, we'll have a pretty good size mini fridge when you compare this to maybe a different style, fifth wheel, same size. Typically, it's just gonna be a smaller mini fridge. This is more of like a dorm style. Also, we'll have hot and cold knobs on the sink, and you guys will have a light out here to see what you're doing, and you can push that button to control if it does come off and on, just like all the lights inside the camper that way too. Lots of storage up ahead for cooking utensils, seasonings, whatever you guys want there. And you will have your Elite Series griddle. That's going to be like a Blackstone cooking surface. Good for breakfast, bacon, hamburgers, whatever you guys want to cook on there. Put a nice little grease trap in there. You guys will have your bottle opener. All right here, guys. Now to the rear of the coach. Automatically going to notice up ahead where I'll start at, you guys will have backup camera prep. We do, do sell the Furion backup camera in the parts store. That will be more of an observation camera, so it's going to stay on 24-7. That way you guys can use that as like a security camera. And then when you guys are traveling, you can be a defensive driver, know if someone's coming up on you pretty quick. We'll have a nice access door in the rear of the coach. 
you guys do have you know, kids there that are going to be using the bunk area, friends, relatives that need to use the restroom, they aren't traveling through the, your whole entire main quarters of your camper to use your guys' bathroom and they're in the front of the camper. Not tracking in mud, dogs aren't running everywhere. You guys will have a shower, toilet in there, super easy access. Flip down stairs there, and also going to have all of your dump station right here conveniently located. Now the living quarters here of the 356 QB. Tons of overhead storage. You guys will find that nice for DVDs, whatever you guys need to stow away. Also going to have a big TV there as a center of attention. That will also pull kind of out of the wall a little bit, and you guys can move it to adjust your viewing angle. Here's that head unit I was talking about. That's going to be Bluetooth, CD player, tuner. Sirius XM radio is also built into that. You guys can play it out of both these speakers, or you guys can control if it plays outside, inside. Again, all, all three zones there. Also going to have a fireplace. That's 32 inch. We do have it on in here. Puts out a good amount of heat, about 5,100 BTUs. Helps supplement that furnace a little bit if you guys are doing a little cold weather camping. Again, tons of storage on both sides of the unit. We'll roll right over here. It's going to be a high to bed sofa. So that, that just pop out, folds out again. Another sleeping area. If you guys do place a custom order or something like that, you guys do have a theater seating option there also. Right here, guys. It's going to be Furion's 12 volt refrigerator option here in the Heritage Glen. That's going to run off of just normal electric 12 volt power off your tow vehicle, maybe off a solar panel you guys had installed on the top. And that's black stainless too. Shows smudges a lot less easier and it scratches a lot less easier too. There's not compared to dealing with a normal stainless. They switch to that black. Doesn't dent very often either. That's another big reason they switch to that. Nice clear viewing um, area there. You guys can see what's in the refrigerator. Down here on the bottom, both of those doors will be your freezer and a bunch of cool little storage compartments in there also. Alrighty here guys, showing you that U-shaped dinette. So you give guys do you have a bunch of kids, have a bunch of friends, you guys can all squash there around the U-shaped dinette. This will also drop flat. Cushions will go on top of that. Another lounge to view the TV, possibly. Maybe two small adults, a couple children can also sleep on that. Right across the way here, going to have your guys' big farmhouse style sink. That's going to be stainless steel. Big pots and pans can fit in there. Also with your pull down sprayer to wash those out. Lots of overhead storage, accent lighting above the top, kind of like a little farmhouse style. I really do enjoy the Heritage Glen concept here. Nice backsplash. It's not just your wallpaper, guys. It's going to be actual backsplash. Don't have to worry about it peeling, fading throughout the years. Furion style appliances. Going to have a black stainless front there on that microwave range complete with the uh, fan and the light. Also going to have your glass um, cooktop here that's going to lift up form another backsplash you guys can wipe that down instead of cleaning the actual backsplash off more storage underneath the oven and then a pretty good size oven compared to what's normally inside a, a unit this size also with complete more of a kind of a pantry style over here over here to the rear of the coach here guys this is going to be your bunk area so you guys do have two opposing slides it's huge Bunch of room in here. You guys can do like a nice gaming setup if your kids are into video games. TV hookups. That way you guys can install a TV in here. The nice thing about this is your guys' company can shut the door. They have their own space. If it's rainy out, you guys aren't bothering. You know, in the main area of the camper, enjoy their time in here. Bunk above here. That's the entertainment center TV hookup I was talking about. Good size flat screen will fit into there. Stash here for video games, etc. Also going to have a big wardrobe over here for clothes, whatever you guys want to stow away here. This is going to be your guys' Jiffy sofa. Heritage Glen came out with this big block of mattress pad here that folds out to a bed. So that's split in half right now, folds out again. It's going to be like about a full size, queen size bed there. Couch cushions are also removable. You can put one back here, kind of make a cool little lounge. Also going to have another bunk here. This will lift up. And you guys do have a nice area to sit there, maybe play some games on the TV. Righty here, guys. Bunk room right behind me. This is going to be your second bath. This bath the company is going to use. Maybe your children. That way they're not tracking stuff throughout the whole camper. They could take a shower here. Nice little step up there. That's going to fit, you know, six foot, six foot four person right there. Nice little storage here in the side of the shower. 
stainless steel sink too. Sometimes most companies do cheap out, just put a plastic sink there. We'll have stainless steel. Big, big uh, medicine cabinet there that will open up, plenty of storage. Uh, toilet there is in very good position. You know, your feet aren't gonna be hanging out of the door. You guys can shut both doors, sit comfortably there with a bunch of storage overhead. All right, here guys, now to the master bedroom here of this coach. First thing you guys are gonna notice, you're gonna be able to walk around both sides of the bed very easily. You guys can stand over here, get dressed for the day. Don't have to worry about crawling over the bed there to, to get to either side. Nice little headboard there. Again, they try to do this nice little modern farmhouse style kind of feel. Also underneath the bed, you guys will have plenty of storage here. Something people always forget about. We'll have your guys' TV hookups here. TV backer here, you guys can mount, move around again to your viewing position. Nice little dresser here. Up here near the front of the camper, let me move out of the way here a little bit. Washer, dryer prep already. So if you guys don't need a stackable, don't need a combo unit, this makes for more storage. Hang up some clothes up here, and then both sides will open up too, guys. So let me pop this other side open for you. Again, tons of storage up there. Shoes, whatever you guys want to stash there. Another rod that goes across the side, hanging up clothes, kind of a his and her style setup. All right, here, guys. Now to the master bathroom here of this unit. Again, you guys are going to notice a nice stainless steel sink there. I'm going to have a medicine cabinet that will open up. Tons of storage behind there. Also, we'll have a nice skylight. Skylight. Taller guys will appreciate that. About four or five more inches of headroom. Also, a nice glass shower enclosure on that. And again, over here, you guys will have a nice little storage racks that Heritage Glen puts up for you. Something, again, you don't shy away from this unit. Tons and tons of storage. Bathroom here. Toilet is going to be in perfect position. You guys' feet aren't going to be hanging out of the doorway. Right here, guys. Again, my name is Nathan Anderson. appreciate your time here. Do have a couple of these 356 QBs in stock. If you are interested, please contact my sales team at Team Anderson. That's going to be 937-649-5823.